Imagine a starlit night. San Francisco shimmers below, its city lights twinkling like a sea of stars. The Golden Gate Bridge stands majestically, a silent guardian over the bay. A plane descends, carrying over 100 souls, each with their own stories, dreams, and destinations. The passengers are unaware of the drama about to unfold. It's Air Canada Flight 759, a routine red-eye from Toronto. The crew is experienced, the aircraft well-maintained, and the flight plan meticulously charted. But this night, the ordinary becomes extraordinary. The calm routine of a red-eye flight is shattered by a series of events that no one could have predicted. A chilling close call awaits. The landing gear deploys, but something is amiss. The runway lights blur with the taxiway lights creating a dangerous illusion. This is the story of how disaster almost struck, a story of human error and the thin line between safety and catastrophe in the skies. The pilots, trained for countless scenarios, find themselves in a situation that tests their skills and nerves to the limit. On July 7, 2017, the aviation world held its breath. Air traffic controllers, pilots and passengers were all part of a tense drama playing out in real time. Flight 759 came within a hair's breadth of colliding with multiple aircraft on the ground. The margin for error was razor thin, and the consequences could have been catastrophic. It's a story that sends shivers down your spine, a stark reminder of the importance of vigilance and the unforgiving nature of air travel. The quick thinking and decisive actions of the pilots and air traffic controllers averted what could have been one of the worst disasters in aviation history. This incident underscores the critical importance of training, communication, and the human element in ensuring the safety of air travel. The Airbus A320, a workhorse of the skies, approached San Francisco International Airport. On board, passengers settled in, eager to disembark after their journey. The flight crew, seasoned professionals, prepared for a routine landing. The night was clear, visibility good, nothing seemed to miss, but the seemingly routine landing held hidden dangers. Unbeknownst to the pilots, a perfect storm of errors and miscommunications was brewing. This would push them to their limits, testing their skill and nerve in a fight to save their passengers and themselves. As Flight 759 descended, the first signs of trouble emerged. The pilots, cleared to land on runway 28 right, misidentified it. They lined up instead with Taxiway Charlie, a parallel strip where four planes were parked, lights ablaze, a potentially catastrophic mistake. Adding to the confusion, communication between the pilots and air traffic control was riddled with missed calls and misunderstandings. Critical information, lost in the night air, heightened the risk. The stage was set for a disaster. The Airbus, now dangerously close to the ground, flew directly over the first aircraft on Taxiway Charlie. The pilots of the parked planes watched in horror, expecting the worst. On board Flight 759, some passengers sensed the aircraft flying too low, their unease growing. In the control tower, alarm shrieked, warning of a potential collision. The air traffic controller's voice, usually calm and measured, rose in urgency. Air Canada 759, where are you going? Go around! The situation was critical. Section 5. Averting Disaster. The pilot's split-second decision. The pilots of Flight 759, jolted by the controller's urgent call and their own proximity to the ground, reacted with lightning speed. They initiated a go-around, pushing the throttles forward and pulling the aircraft up just in the nick of time. The Airbus, engines roaring, climbed steeply into the night sky, narrowly avoiding a catastrophic collision. The planes on the taxiway, bathed in the glow of the ascending aircraft, remained untouched. Disaster had been averted, but only just. Section 6, Aftermath and Investigation, Unraveling the Close Call The near miss of Flight 759 sent shockwaves through the aviation world. The incident, a chilling example of how easily disaster can strike, became the subject of an intensive investigation by the National Transportation Safety Board, or NTSB. The investigation, a meticulous search for answers, involved analyzing cockpit voice recordings, air traffic control communications, and radar data. The goal was clear, to understand the chain of events that led to the near collision and to prevent a similar incident from happening again. Section 7. The Role of Human Error, Fatigue, Tunnel Vision, and Complacency. These three factors are often interlinked and can have devastating consequences in aviation. 
The NTSB investigation revealed that human error played a significant role in the near disaster. The detailed analysis showed how fatigue, tunnel vision and complacency contributed to the sequence of events. The pilots of Flight 759, fatigued after a long flight, misidentified the runway. Their exhaustion impaired their judgment and reaction times, making it difficult to perform even routine tasks. This mistake was exacerbated by the late hour and dimmed lighting which further strained their already tired eyes. The low visibility conditions made it challenging to distinguish between the runway and taxiway. Furthermore, the investigation highlighted the dangers of tunnel vision. This phenomenon occurs when pilots become so focused on a single task that they miss other critical information, which can be crucial for safe flight operations. In this case, the pilot's fixation on landing may have blinded them to the presence of the aircraft on the taxiway. Their intense concentration on the landing procedure caused them to overlook other important indicators and warnings. The combination of fatigue, tunnel vision and complacency created a perfect storm of human error. The pilot's inability to maintain situational awareness led to a near miss that could have been catastrophic. This incident underscores the importance of addressing human factors in aviation safety to prevent similar occurrences in the future. Section 8. Systemic Issues – Examining the Role of Airport Design and Procedures While pilot error was a contributing factor, the NTSB investigation also uncovered systemic issues that increased the risk of an incident. The layout of San Francisco International Airport, with its closely spaced runways and taxiways, created a situation ripe for confusion. Additionally, the investigation found that air traffic control procedures, while generally sound, could be improved to enhance communication and reduce the workload on controllers, especially during busy periods. Section 9. Lessons Learned – Implementing Changes to Prevent Future Incidents The near collision of Flight 759 served as a wake-up call for the aviation industry. The NTSB in its final report issued a series of recommendations aimed at preventing similar incidents from occurring in the future. These recommendations included improving pilot training, enhancing airport lighting and signage, and refining air traffic control procedures. The aviation industry, taking the lessons of Flight 759 to heart, implemented many of these recommendations, further strengthening the safety net that protects air travelers. Section 10. The Importance of Aviation Safety, A Never-Ending Mission The story of Air Canada Flight 759 is a powerful reminder of the importance of aviation safety. It highlights the critical role that pilots, air traffic controllers and countless other aviation professionals play in ensuring that air travel remains one of the safest forms of transportation. The pursuit of aviation safety is a never-ending mission, requiring constant vigilance, technological advancements, and a commitment to learning from past mistakes. Every near miss, every incident, provides an opportunity to improve and to make the skies safer for everyone. Section 11. Conclusion. A stark reminder of the fragility of air travel. The near disaster of Air Canada Flight 759 serves as a stark reminder of the fragility of air travel. This incident, which could have ended in tragedy, highlights the delicate balance that exists in the world of aviation. It underscores the fact that even in the highly controlled environment of commercial aviation, things can go wrong. Despite rigorous training, advanced technology, and strict regulations, the human element introduces a level of unpredictability. Human error, coupled with systemic vulnerabilities, can have potentially catastrophic consequences. The intricate dance between pilots, air traffic controllers, and ground crew is a testament to the complexity of air travel. Yet, amidst the stark reality of this near miss, there is also a glimmer of hope. The aviation industry is built on a foundation of continuous improvement and learning from past mistakes. The fact that disaster was averted thanks to the quick thinking of the pilots and the vigilance of air traffic control is a testament to the resilience of the aviation system. Their ability to remain calm under pressure and make split-second decisions is commendable. This incident also serves as a reminder of the importance of ongoing training and preparedness. The aviation industry invests heavily in simulations and emergency drills to ensure that all personnel are ready to handle unexpected situations. The dedication of the professionals who keep us safe in the skies is unwavering. From the ground crew to the pilots, each person plays a crucial role in ensuring the safety and efficiency of air travel. 
Their commitment to excellence is what makes flying one of the safest modes of transportation.